This could be field trips. So, oh, this video. One of the bigger field trips we went on, as we went on many, was probably Barbados. Even though it wasn't really like a class kind of thing, we went with the GLP students, as you remember. And I learned a lot, and that was probably my favorite because we got to experience new cultures. What do you got here? Um, so I have two scales here. One side is all my successes, one's all my failures. So this is from the Ornament Project, and this is from MC Shikaz on our YouTube channel. And this is like all like the failures. But like both have taught me like great skills and lead to my end goal, which is success. Mm -hmm. And here are like the exit. What do you got? Okay, so let's start with this basket. I have. The color yellow represents the wall we and two other classmates painted yellow. Mm -hmm. um, the, we painted the wall yellow because it like had, it had like a good effect on like people, like friends of the mood. I put it all in this yellow basket because we did a project where we filled a basket filled with food and brought it to people that were in need. This bird here represents Twitter because we use Twitter a lot to connect with people over social media. This swan here represents freedom. We have the freedom to do not as we please, like there's boundaries, but we have, we have a lot of freedom then like that we wouldn't have in like another classroom. This lunch menu here is used to represent choice because you choose what you want to learn on, what you want to learn about. Like you wouldn't go to a menu and choose some a lunch uh, place and choose something you don't want to eat, right? So you choose what you want to work on, something that you're passionate about. And these mazes here are shown to represent um, failure and the obstacles that you face while doing these projects. Like as I said, like you're not gonna get this maze done first try. You're gonna run into these obstacles, and once you have the, once you run into the obstacles, you have to go back. Look So I brought my skis in. Uh, a lot of what I was talking about through the year was education and how we can engage uh, our students um, with the curriculum that we have now, but also with, with what they're interested in. So like my biggest motivation what drives me is skiing. So I talked about how I relate like my skiing back to school and like, how I do things um, to motivate myself in school, but also like do things that I'm interested in. And then also I have this little puzzle here. And what I like to think of this as is our education. And uh, so if you look at the box, this is our education, and we try and put all the different types of students into the same box, but if we just put them in, then it's not going to fit, but if we take time and analyze how we can make everyone work in the same school system together, I think that's what we really need to do, and so I think what we've done right now is try to force everybody into the same box, but we haven't, haven't actually taken a look on how to analyze and make everybody work together within the same system. We've kind of just forced people into the same system and we have to realize that it doesn't actually work um, for every different type of student. So that's what I'm trying to express to people. And then also I have like my blog over here which I talk about education. I'm just getting that fired up. And so that's the sum of it.